Lewis Walpert CBEFRSFRSLF Med Sai was a South African born British developmental biologist, author, and broadcaster. Walpert was best known for his French flag model of embryonic development, where he used the French flag as a visual aid to explain how embryonic cells interpret genetic code for expressing characteristics of living organisms and explaining how signaling between cells early in morphogenesis could be used to inform cells with the same genetic regulatory network of their position and role. He was also an author of several science books including Triumph of the Embryo and How We Live and Why We Die, The Secret Lives of Cells. Walpert was born on 19 October 1929 in Johannesburg to Sarah and William Walpert in a South African. Jewish family of Lithuanian Jewish origin. His father was bookshop manager and newsagent. His aunt, Helen Suzman, was a South African anti-apartheid activist and politician. He completed his Bachelor's of Science in Civil Engineering at the University of Witwaters Rand in Johannesburg where he was exposed to progressive politics and communist ideas and had also met Nelson Mandela in 1952. He worked as an assistant to the director of Building Research Institute, Pretoria. Before going to Israel and working for the Water Planning Board, he went on to study soil mechanics at the Imperial College London and later completed his doctorate from King's College London under biophysicist James Danielli. Walpert shifted focus to applying his knowledge of soil mechanics to studying the science of dividing cells at a recommendation of a friend in South Africa. Partnering with Trigway Gustafson he worked toward measuring the mechanical forces in cellular division. He served as a lecturer and then a reader in King's College London. He went on to hold the position of Emeritus Professor of Biology as applied to medicine in the Department of Anatomy and Developmental Biology at University College London until his retirement. At 74, Walpert was best known for the French flag model of embryonic development which he put forward in a 1969 paper Positional Information and the Spatial Pattern of Cellular Differentiation in the Journal of Theoretical Biology. The model uses the French tricolor flag to visually depict how embryonic cells can interpret genetic code to create the same patterns even when some pieces of the embryo are removed. The model further explains how signaling between cells early in morphogenesis could be used to inform cells with the same genetic regulatory network of their position and role. The model was based on Walpert's research on sea urchin eggs and provided a framework for research into gastrulation, the embryonic process during which a living organism's body plan is established. Walpert is credited with the quote, It is not birth, marriage, or death, but gastrulation which is truly the most important time in your life. Biologists recognize Walpert for elaborating and championing the ideas of positional information and positional value, molecular signals and internal cellular responses to them that enable cells to do the right thing in the right place during embryonic development. The essence of these concepts is that there is a dedicated set of molecules for spatial coordination of cells, identical across many species and across different developmental stages and tissues. The discovery of Hawkes gene codes in flies and vertebrates has largely vindicated Walpert's positional value concept, while identification of growth factor morphogens in many species has supported the concept of positional information. In a 2005 article entitled Spiked, The Guardian asked a series of scientists, What is the one thing everyone should learn about? Science. Walpert responded, I would teach the world that science is the best way to understand the world. And that for any set of observations, there is only one correct explanation. Also, science is value-free, as it explains the world as it is. Ethical issues arise only when science is applied to technology, from medicine to industry. Of his book How We Live and Why We Die, The Secret Lives of Cells, Walpert said the intended audience of his book was the general public. He said he thought the general public needed to understand that people are a society of cells, particularly if they wanted to understand humans. Walpert also believed that one very important and so far unsolved question in cellular research is the origins and evolution of the first cell, as well as the question of cell behavior, which in his opinion would be useful for the study of illnesses such as cancer or Alzheimer's disease. Walpert debated with Christian philosopher William Lane Craig about the existence of God. 
Christian astrophysicist Hugh Ross on whether there is a case for a creator, and William Deemsky on the topic of intelligent design. In a lecture entitled, Is Science Dangerous? Quote, he expanded on this, I regard it as ethically unacceptable and impractical too.